from she? Hi, baby. Hi, everyone. I'm Alice. Alright, so today we'd like to share with you part two of our South Korea vlog. And in case you haven't watched the first part, it's already uploaded. I think a good tip you can get from that is you can rent a Wi-Fi device mm -hmm. once you get to the airport in Incheon. So wherever you go, you won't get lost or anything. Mm -hmm. Especially in our case, because during our four days stay there, talaga. Oh my god, I have a very poor sense of direction and basically just relied on that Wi-Fi device. So it's it's a great thing. It's actually impressive because when you're in Seoul, oh, one of the best things there is talaga yung Wi-Fi nila is fast aside from it being cheap. So it's really highly recommended that you rent one when you go there. So where can they get it? Mm -hmm. So in our case, what I did first was to uh, buy a voucher from... Uh, Klook.com. That's K L O O K dot com. So I paid 133 pesos uh, per day, and then when we got to Incheon, we just presented the voucher there, and they gave us the the Wi-Fi device. In our limited stay in Seoul, we wanted to cover as many places as we could. Mm -hmm. So what we did on our first day was to avail of a hop on hop of tour bus which goes around mm -hmm. uh, different places, bring to different places, different palaces, traditional cities. Korean villages and shopping districts. Mm. Here's part two of South Korea vlog. We hope you give this a like. Please subscribe to our channel. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you soon. Radio
So we just had quite a long hike up here and we're about to enter the Nam San Seoul Tower again via the hop on hop off bus. <laughs> So good, okay, is a